The International Space Station adjusted its orbit for the first time in 2022 on Wednesday. The adaptation is reportedly to facilitate the upcoming docking and departure of two Soyuz crewed spacecrafts. Why did docking and departing the ISS require an orbital maneuver? How much does it usually cost? Space expert Yang Yuguang tells us more. For a manned spacecraft or a cargo spacecraft, if it wants to dock to a space station, the basic requirement is to launch the spacecraft into the same orbital plane of the station. For instance, the Soyuz spacecraft need be launched、uh, when the launch site,、uh, along with the rotation of the Earth, passing through the、uh, orbital plane of the International Space Station. Theoretically speaking, there are launch window every day, but usually when the spacecraft is launched into orbit. The International Space Station in a different、uh, location. So for the long rendezvous, it also needs time for the adjustment of its position in orbit. Ten years ago, three days were needed, but now a maximum of six and a half hours is all that's required for the spacecraft to complete the rendezvous procedure that will lead to docking. Thanks to the accelerated rendezvous and docking technology. A technique that reduces the space motion sickness that normally appears after six hours of orbiting. But to achieve this, it raises a very strict requirement to the orbit or the position of the International Space Station. That is the reason why they need to adjust the altitude, uh, altitude uh, and also the orbit of the International Space Station, which will make the fast rendezvous and docking possible. This time, the ISS will be raised by 850 meters to welcome the Soyuz MS-21 that is scheduled to launch on March 18, and to say goodbye to the Soyuz MS-19 that is scheduled to return to Earth on March 29. An orbit maneuver for a space station is not that unusual, but it is quite expensive. Well, to avoid the influence of the dangerous radiation to the health of、uh, astronauts, usually、uh, we adopt the altitude about three、uh, hundred kilometers to four hundred kilometers for a space station. But this this is another problem because of the、uh, air density of the atmosphere. At this altitude is relatively high. The aerodynamic、uh, drag is also remarkable.、Uh, so that is the reason why the space station need to conduct orbit maneuver constantly to keep its orbit to keep its altitude. To achieve this,、uh, usually we need the propulsion system from the station itself or from a, a cargo spacecraft. And the refueling is a very important technology to achieve this,、uh, which means that we transfer the propellant from the cargo ship、uh, to the station's propulsion system. Usually, the cost of a cargo ship is more than twenty million dollars. But also, the cargo ship brought the、uh, resupplies for the astronaut and also scientific research instruments to the station. So it is a little bit complicated to cal- calculate、uh, the cost of the propellant itself.